Greetings. Welcome to me and each other. Well, this is the reading for Musculan for 4th Jan 2017. The reading is quite big and it's all about the energy surrounding. So I'm just doing it a separate reading for Musculan. Let's move on. The first card for you is Speechless. This card is all about um, what is happening in your life. You might have gone through some days when you were together with your twin flame enjoying every single moment when you are laughing, smiling, caressing, kissing, whatever. That moment could come in your life if you are really enjoying the day with your twin flame. If you are together, you will be the happiest one. If you are not, then it would be the worst thing in your life because uh, you could encounter some moments when you could become angry on your twin flame, knowing that she is not with you. Maybe because of any reason, maybe you're away for work or maybe um, she's away from you because you got separate. So whatever things could be there, if this part could come in your life. So you need to understand, evaluate your emotion and do not hold on to your anger. Let the anger calm down immediately. The next card for you is someone is interfering in reverse. So this card is all about the kind of intuition that someone is interfering in your life. Now, who is that someone? That someone is like a third, third person who is meddling and who is trying to uh, capture your mind. So for example, say if you are not convincing for any work and you are the boss and someone would try to convince you by using some energy or there could be some people who would try to uh, make your life more nasty. So just pay attention to it. There could be someone who is working against you. The next card for you is candlelight. So this is the kind of sign when you need to clear any kind of energy attack as soon as possible. Or if you feel like that nothing is as good, then just clear it. Because it could result into something drastic more. For example, say, uh, suppose you're driving a car and you just found like something is not good. It could be the axle, or it could be like the wheels or engine, whatever and you did not uh, find out what is that you just got the intuition but didn't do that and then later in the evening it your car really gets damaged and you're left alone on the road without any help so this kind of example could happen in your life so just try to pay attention if anything is there which you find you know uh, pay attention to it just do it immediately the next card for you is planning reverse so if you think that you're going to plan out something for you today it may not work for you as usual so it's like suppose uh, earlier you used to be the best programmer but today it could be some delay with your planning maybe um, you won't get the best at all maybe something could happen and you would feel like that what is happening exactly because you would feel like uh, I'm not having that kind of enough energy or whatever I'm doing those things are not getting accomplished it's because someone is working against you or sending some kind of energy which is not giving you the proper weightage for example, um, sometimes a player um, does everything. Like say in tennis, the person does signs of winners and whatever, but still he loses because it is not his day. So this could be not your day. So just try to pay attention to it. The next card for you is I want my relationship back. This is a kind of critical notion which you are going against you. It's like say, suppose you just got a kind of fight with your twin flame or fight with your lover and just went out and in that kind of agony or in that kind of um, vengeance suppose you just meet someone and you just feel like that that person wants to communicate with you and you just feel like that why not to give her a chance maybe just try to communicate with you on a friend level this could go against you I want my relationship back is like you want to be with your twin flame but then you are not accepting it maybe your ego is too big and you're holding on to your ego Always remember, when it is all about love, then ego never stands out. The moment your ego stands out between you and relationship, know that your relationship is dead end at that moment. The next card for you is tears. This card will come when you will either ultimately damage your negative cycle, 20%, or 60% chances that when you will repent of how did you behave or why you're not closer with your twin flame 
20% chance is that someone would try to make you cry at all. And that person could be a person with vengeance for you. Today's card for you is I am there. This is a kind of critical sign by energy where I could feel like that a kind of energy is sending you this kind of information and this kind of uh, presence that there is something which could lead you to trouble. You need to understand two things that you should be available to your family and second you should be available to your twin flame or to your lover. These are two things. Beyond that if there is anyone, anything else and that could be misleading information. The next card for you is perfume. So this is a kind of uh, critical approach where you could feel lots of sexual and that thing could lead you to a not good level. For example, say you feel very close to your twin flame and maybe you just want to be with her but because of certain reasons you're not able to go to her. But then if you go to party or if you just meet someone and that someone is just crazy to go for just enjoyment, what do you think? If you follow that route, you would find yourself into a negative cycle. So just don't do it. The next card for you is I will be on your side reverse. So somehow you're trying to stop yourself from getting overwhelmed or from getting drawn. So you know that you have limits, you have to be with your lover or whatever has happened a week before or that the kind of strategy which you had like maybe you are raising your ego you need to cut it down so I will be on your side is like the time is a moment when you need to understand that there are times in our lives when we need to say sorry to someone and when we say sorry we don't become a person who has done a kind of mishap no you become the person who has the big heart so just pay attention to it the next card you have several relationships so that moment maybe in the evening or since say 4 p.m. you would encounter some feelings where you will try to rejuvenate with your relationship module so there's a big chance when you could try to communicate with your lover or twin flame through text message or through calls you could uh, end up with the chat or just call worth just a minute or less than a minute but that could be an essential thing for you the next card for you is I miss you this is a thing when you are going to connect with your lover and uh, you are really going to feel the kind of difference you have had since you left your lover so you know there are people who just connect to um, a person for selfishness but when you talk about the true twin flame experience, then you are actually waiting for that overwhelming experience when your soul gets connected to that person's soul, when you become just one emotionally and spiritually and physically just become one. And that is the amazing thing about the relationship. And you have gone through it. But then the thing is that if you are away, even if it's for say for job or for any kind of purpose, you would try to think about your twin flame. And you will try to let her know. The next card for you is breakup time. Breakup time is like uh, you will try to end up the negative cycle around you. And also, if there is a person who has been interfering in your life or meddling in your life, knowing that you are actually engaged with someone, you could try to break up with that person. 20 to 30 percent chance is over there. Still, it depends on you. The next card for you is listen my words. This is where 20% chance is there where you could remember the arguments which happened between you and your lover. 60% chance that you will try to communicate with your lover and you will try to explain exactly what happened and what is the reason behind all this stuff. And 20% chance is there when you would try to say sorry by keeping your ego away. So all of these things could happen depending on what kind of choice you do and the final card for you is flowers this card comes when you will be shown true colors by the nature you could be compelled to communicate with your lover and letting her know that what do you really think about her what is so much important for you and her in the life 
and what do you think about her you actually feel about her but the only thing is that you don't let her know that you have these feelings and this is creating chaos see if you want to communicate with her do it directly because she belongs to you for example say uh, you are working on a project and suddenly something damaged you tell directly to the person in charge that this thing happened we need to stop this project immediately why aren't you afraid of something uh, a positive positive could happen you are aware but then you want to save other people from getting harmed and you accept your responsibility and you take the huge risk but what happens you win and they stop the project for a certain time similar is here you just need to let her know what do you feel about her once you let her know then you will see the difference so this is reading for you hope it will resonate thank you take care and lots of blessings